You'll need allspice. You'll need some chamomile. Some vervain. A few cinnamon sticks. Some jasmine flower. Honey. A nice jar with a really good sealed lid. I use Florida water to cleanse my jar. Some gold glitter or dust. This is a cedar wood instant cone. Some position paper. This is actually just cardstock. You'll need paper money. I chose a dollar and I also have some pennies that I'm adding in. Off camera, I've already cleansed my jar and all of my utensils with using my Florida water. Now I'm preparing my instant cone, which is cedar wood, to further cleanse my jar. I did forget to show these bay leaves, which have actual intentions written on the other side and just some dollar signs on the back side. I have a little piece of magnet and I have some extra clothes that I just wanted to add in. You're going to see me just move my jar around just a little bit to make sure that the smudge gets all the way through, even though it's smoke, I know, but it's a habit of mine and I don't plan on changing it. I decided to add in two cinnamon sticks this time. I kind of just go with the flow of how I feel and use my intuition. I also forgot to mention that I use a green marker to write on the bay leaves along with on top of my lid. I don't think I show the top of my lid um, in this video, but after everything is sealed, I do right on top of it. And now I'm going to add in a few pieces of allspice. Now it's time for our cloves. Here goes our jasmine flowers. I wouldn't add all of this that's in my hand, that's why I'm just picking out a few. But do with it as you may, it is yours. Now here is our chamomile. I was actually thinking about sifting that jar down um, to save myself on some time when I'm packing orders or I'm doing any kind of work, but I haven't done it yet. Here's our vervain. This actually is all going to go in there. I don't know why I decided to scoop it instead of just shaking it in. Here is my partition paper, which I've already written on and I'm folding towards myself. I really just fold it until it's small enough to actually fit inside of the jar. I don't have like a set number. I do it until it feels right. Now for our coins, in this case pennies, and our dollar bills. Um, I thought I recorded them putting the pennies in there, I guess I didn't, but you can see it in the jar. And I'm actually going to cut them up. Now I cut them up so that I can spread them throughout the jar and st stick them down on the sides. But again, do what feels right to you. Now you can purchase magnets. I have a sheet of magnet that I just kind of rip off a piece and cut them up and 
drop it inside of the jar. This is just some gold glitter. I'm trying to think if this was from my mica set because I also make candles. So I had this already in my house. I didn't have to go out and look for this or purchase it. It comes in a set. So it just made it a little bit easier and this spoon makes it less messy. Now for the honey. Now you see me just pouring it right on top, but I actually try to get it through the cinnamon sticks but you'll see that it'll all reach all the way at the bottom i kind of wait for the air bubbles in the pockets to come up to the top and i'll shake it down or tap the sides to make sure it gets all the way down at the bottom i'm actually gonna speed this up or cut it out because i'm sure you guys don't want to see me just pouring honey pour it until it's filled <laughs> Here I'm just sealing it. Um, yes, this is a mason jar, but I believe you have to like put mason jars into a pot or something like that for the extra seal. I just glue it down because this is not to be reopened or reused. And I just checked at the end of the video and I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. So I'm not gonna re-record it because it wouldn't be genuine. In this next clip, you're going to see me just moving the honey and the contents around because after this, I actually glue a thumbtack to the lid and I stick a green candle onto it and I will actually burn that candle to kind of give the um, jar a wax seal as well. And that's how I do it. What ingredients do you use to make your money jars? If you need help making one, 